I found this really cute tea towel at Marshall's for $6.99. They have so many good ones there, and I just love this. Uh, it's this American Gnome, and the first tea towel had the gnome on there, and the second one had the grain sack stripes. I'm going to start by connecting the two um, at either seam, and I'm using a hot glue stick called Sherbond for fabric. This is washable. You can get this at Hobby Lobby. And this is kind of how I want this all to look in the end. So I have this 16 inch pillow that I'm going to put in um, my tea towels here and kind of make a plan. I have a chalk pencil that I can mark on either side where I want my um, closures to be. So I'm going to put the two inside out and I'm going to mark off where I'm going to want to run the sure bond to close up my sides. I'm going to run the sure bond down where I would stitch if I was using a sewing machine. Again, I know a lot of people are going to ask. This is washable. It is sure bond. It is a fabric glue stick. And I hear I made like a little sack. I'm now going to cut the excess material off from either side. Using my pinking shears. Any scissors would do. And then I'm going to pull my sack back right side out. And I'm going to fit my pillow inside so I can kind of get a look at what I got here. It was a lot of pillow in and pillow out as I was creating this uh, pillowcase. And this is what I'm going to want. So for the meantime, I'm going to take this extra fabric and tuck it on the inside. And I'm going to create this flap. It's a little long. And I'm going to hold it with some pins. I'm going to pull the pillow back out. And again, I'm going to take my sure bond and start closing up this hemline here. So I'm going to run the glue on the outside hem and on the inside seam. And put my pillow back in and I'm going to fix these little corners and then cut off the excess material and do another hem going along this cut area on the inside. Now I want to be able to have my pillow removable so I can wash this. And I found these big white buttons and these adhesive uh, Velcro at my just a buck. And I'm going to sew on the three buttons going across. And then add my adhesive Velcro. They're little tiny circles that I'm putting underneath the buttons so that you can Velcro this on and off. The glue on these are pretty sticky, but I still add a little bit of the sure bond. And now you can open up your pillowcase and pull out your pillow if need be to wash. 
and then remove back on. I really hope you enjoyed this video. For other tutorials, go check us out on YouTube. You can now watch all our videos at chalkitupfancy.com. For any paint products, tissue paper, transfer, or mesh stencils, chalkitupfancy.com.